Good Sunday morning to you. I'm Storm Track 8 meteorologist Marcus Bailey. Thanks for logging on to wishtv.com and the Storm Track 8 weather app. Had some snow for your Saturday night. That has now cleared the area, and we should be in for a quiet end to the weekend. Clouds early, those will start to erode as we head into the afternoon. So I think a decent amount of sunshine. Numbers are going to struggle still a bit, only into the mid to upper 20s, I think, is the best that we can do this afternoon. 23 at noon, 28 around 4 o'clock. Wind chills into the teens through midday, low 20s by this afternoon. Numbers this evening, interesting, will fall quickly once the sun goes down to around 20. That'll be around 9 and 10 o'clock, and then we'll start to climb the ladder a bit. Much warmer air surges in here as we head into the overnight and leading into the open of the work week. So by the time you wake up for your Monday morning, we're close to freezing. That is important. Here's why. Future cast overnight, we're going to stop this at 7 o'clock. We do see bands of precip initially as snow Monday morning. I do think some areas, even though future cast not picking up on this, warm enough that we'll see maybe some rain mixing in from time to time. As we go later on into your Monday then, mid to late morning, you're seeing that transition from snow to rain for much of central Indiana. And that will continue through the afternoon. So there will be some wet roads on the drive home Monday. And then colder air catches up with the precip and we'll switch back over to snow, I think, briefly. We're not talking about a lot of snow here. Maybe in some isolated areas up to a half an inch. That's about it. So not going to be overly problematic. Numbers should make a run at 40 degrees from lunchtime into the afternoon hours before the cold air starts to arrive. And again, that is still on schedule. This Arctic air mass will infiltrate much of the Midwest for the midweek. We're talking near record setting numbers here. Look at the temperature trend from 40 Monday to 15 Tuesday to one above on Wednesday. These are highs teens on Thursday and then back to the mid 20s on Friday. That one that we're forecasting for Wednesday could be a record breaker for the coldest maximum temperature for Wednesday afternoon. Seven is the record. So obviously if we hit that one that will be uh, well, well below that record. Wind chills are going to be the big story here. Watch this as we head into Tuesday morning. Well below zero, five to ten degrees we will say even colder Wednesday morning, 15 to 25 below zero. And Thursday morning, we could get in that range of 20 to 30 degrees below zero. This is going to be dangerous stuff here for the middle of the week, so do be advised of that. Uh, brutally cold air for about a three or four day stretch in the Chapman Heating and Cooling eight day forecast. You'll see quiet conditions with the cold. Next chance of snow coming in on Friday. And then numbers should get closer to average by next weekend. Highs in the middle 30s with a scattered mix moving in next Sunday.